Two chargers behaving differently. ISD TD1 and Toolkit RCM7 AC, both powered by AC. I use ISD TD1 to power my quads on the bench, always connecting through Vifly Short Saver V2. Always works perfectly fine. Not so successful with Toolkit RCM7 AC. ISD TD1. Using DC output with voltage set to 25.2 volts, for 6S setup, and the current set to 1.4 amps, to simulate my 1350 mAh 6S battery. Vifly Short Saver V2 Steady Yellow LED means ready to work. I press the button for 2 amps current threshold, blue LED, right hand side. Finally, press the power button, green LED at the top, to send power to the quad. All works perfectly fine. However, that does not work when I try the same settings with my new charger toolkit RCM7AC. Exactly the same settings as on my ISD TD1. Output voltage is set to 25.2 volts, and the max current to 1.4 amps. This time, when I press start, Vifly Short Saver V2 ends up with red and blue flashing LEDs. What is going on here? Am I doing something wrong? Again. With ISD TD1, identical settings, all works perfectly fine. I've charged, discharged and storage charged batteries with Toolkit RCM7 AC, and it works amazing. I'd love to use my Toolkit RCM7 AC's DC power output option to power my quads or soldering iron when on the bench, just like with ISD TD1.